To be an engineer, you just have to have a no-quit attitude. I always knew I wanted to come here. <laughs> it's right in the backyard, first off. What really drew me to Akron was they were just as competitive as all of the big name schools, but Akron offered me more scholarship opportunities. Akron's one of the better uh, engineering colleges around. Once I got to the University of Akron for the visit, it was just, I felt more at home, more comfortable. The support you'll get here is something that you'll never get anywhere else. We help each other, you know, whether it's old material that you can study from or you're just stuck on a question and you don't want to be there four more hours trying to figure it out. Because if you're just trying to do it alone, it's not going to happen. It's, it's really difficult to do that. You're going to lose your mind. You're going to become stressed. We have study tables twice a week. It's just a great way to network and form friendships. My support system here on campus was definitely the thing that kind of helped me get over the hump. I co-opt last summer with Bridgestone Firestone. Lifting tires, I was fixing machines, getting hands-on work that you can't get in the classroom. So I've been on two different rotations. It really gave me the very good aspect of what a civil engineer does. I was an application developer for Family Heritage Life Insurance. Doing something I love, which is programming, you know, that was the best aspect of that internship for me. I loved it. <laughs> I've done two REUs, or research experience for undergrads, one at the Cleveland Clinic and one at Neomed. It makes me feel like I make an impact, you know? I don't regret my decision at all. I absolutely love it here. My name is Sophia Chinchilla. Joshua Thomas. Travell Wright. Miguel Rodriguez. Latia Bass. And I am a mechanical engineering. Biomedical engineering. Computer engineering. Civil engineering. Biomedical engineering student at the University of Akron. Yeah.